Hi, welcome, and I hope you're doing well. This video here, I'll be showing you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to replace a motherboard on a MacBook Air. This is a 13-inch MacBook Air. The model is A1466, and let's get started. So you need a pantalope screwdriver. Go ahead and remove all the screws at the bottom of the laptop. Okay, once that is done, you can remove the back plate. So the next step is to disconnect the battery. Okay, once you have that removed, um, also I remove the Sorry, I removed the uh, um, the SSD hard drive and removed the cable. Okay, this is the 40 pin connector for the uh, LCD. You can go ahead and disconnect that. This is the Wi-Fi cable. Okay, and this is the uh, the speaker. Go ahead and disconnect the speaker cable. The next thing I'll do is disconnect the um, charging port. And this cable here is for the uh, the screen. So disconnect that. All right, go ahead and flip the uh, the clipper here. And that is for this fan. We're going to remove the fan after. Uh, same thing for this. Go ahead and flip the uh, the clipper. And we have to remove uh, the keyboard. And I believe this is the lighting of the keyboard. Okay, so let's go ahead and remove the fan. Okay, be very careful on the fan ribbon cable. Okay, and put that on the side. Go ahead and remove the screws. Okay, there's one screw here and this screw is kind of all the way at the bottom is hidden by the uh, Wi-Fi cable and this screw here is holding the heat sink okay so far we have done by removing the screws okay and we're going to work on the keyboard uh, ribbon cable okay so this is disconnected
get a tweezer. All right, so there you go. This is a bad motherboard. And we'll be replacing with a new one. Just do the same steps. You want to slide it in first. Make sure you have the um, other cable above the laptop because once it sits on it, it will be covering up the, uh, the cable. So, all right, that looks good. Let me just align them properly. Okay, so double check again, and this is for the LCD, the two cable for the Wi-Fi. We need to transfer the Wi-Fi card back onto here. We have the power battery cable, keyboard lighting. Okay, this is for the screen. All right. That looks good. So let's put the screws back on. First thing I would do is make sure this is the screw all the way here. Have that going. Okay, so we have all the screws go on to the motherboard. Before I forgot, make sure I have the Wi-Fi card transfer over. Let me just clean it up. Okay, here goes the Wi-Fi card. Okay, the two Wi-Fi cable, the short one goes to the top. And then the longer cable Wi-Fi is for the bottom. Okay, both of them are in. Okay, let me go ahead and connect the uh, screen for the pin connector. Once it's connected, you can go ahead and have the clipper to 
clip it in. Here comes the speaker. This is for the battery. And this is for the keyboard. Okay, let's put the SSD hard drive back on. And do not forget the screw. Here comes the uh, LCD cable. Okay, and this is the fan. Make sure you have the uh, the cable goes in first. And once the cable is in, go ahead go ahead and have the clipper to close it. There are three screws that screws the uh, the fan so start with the bottom the one on the right side and here goes to the left okay do not forget the uh, the DC charging cable goes back in all right and finally the cable that connects the uh, the IO board to the motherboard okay so that's pretty much it have the back plate put back Have all the screws. Screw it back in. So I have the uh, the tools in the description below. Um, also the replacement motherboard I do not sell those parts I'm just referring you to Amazon or eBay where you can buy them as a referral I do get a, a few dollars as a percentage by giving you a, a referral link so I would really appreciate if you want to buy the parts through the link that I gave you um, at least it can help me, you know, to get some kind of referral fee. Um, usually just a few dollars for that. Alright, so this is it. Uh, I just replaced the motherboard. And I uh, hope this video helps you. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If any question, comment below. And I'll try to reply you through Facebook or through YouTube. Um, until next time. Please take care.